What is up guys, Mystic7 here, sitting on my bedroom floor in the Bay Area, and today we are on some Clash Royale because, as we all know, a brand new card has been released, and it is the BAM! Oh, interesting. We'll be, we'll be buying that too, that's happening. But the BAM! The Goblin Gang. Gang Gang Squad, YY Fakey Fakey. We can buy a stack for 100, which we will definitely do, and then we're gonna go out and make an, just a ridiculous, stupid, dummy deck and do some classic challenges with it because that's gonna be fun. Okay, let's, let's get this. Buy 100 stack, BAM! That's ours. We now got the Goblin Gang 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 Squad. Dude, oh my gosh! Make it rain, boy. And actually, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need more gold to power these guys up. I'm assuming I'll need more gold. Let me let me find them. Here we go, right here. Okay, let me make a deck with the goblins, and then we'll get on with this video. Okay, so I was really iffy on bringing the golem along, but I figured we have nothing to defend. We have no tank. If someone has a zap or arrows or a fireball which probably will happen, they're gonna kill us. So we need to bring a golem, or at least something to take the heat off the goblins, but we have a lot of upgrading to do. We're gonna start with the goblin gang, because obviously new card, we have to start with them. And uh, let's see how high we can get it. I'm saying, what, level six? Usually you can get it right off the bat if you just buy it with 100 gems. 100 gems, by the way, is not incredibly cheap, but it's not very expensive. Level six. Oh, we're still going, bro. Level seven? I'm tripping. Okay, we got level eight. Wow, <laughs> level eight goblin gang right off the bat, and I do have... Also, a Spear Goblin upgrade, and then a Goblin Hut upgrade, so we need more gold. I don't have enough gold. Oh, wait, wait, we can do this. I forgot we had this special offer. Okay, we got a Super Magical chest opening right now. I haven't opened a Super Magical in a very long time. All right, 3,300 gold. That's going to help a lot. And then, more Dark, okay, awesome. We get rock level on. We can get some Dark Goblin upgrades going, too, because we're using that. Oh, the Clone Spell. I need that really bad. I didn't, I was thinking, I was like, I need to put the Clone Spell in this deck because we got to clone these Goblins. We have the, I just unlocked it. That shows you how much I've been playing this game. Game. Clone spell, awesome. Wow, 482 elite barb cards, 10 executioner cards, and uh, 10 tornadoes. Dude, we are getting, this is like the best super magical I've ever had. 118 battle rams, okay. And then we got a legendary, we got a lava hound out of that. That was, and look at that, oh my god. That's worth 10 bucks, and then we got a bunch of stuff there too, including a bunch of gold and what have you. So let's buy a little bit more gold because, oh my gosh, I've got to upgrade a lot of stuff now. Let's get our goblin hut going to level 9. Sweet, and then we can get our Spear Goblins actually up to level 11, so we're pretty close, kind of close to getting them maxed, and then we can get our Dark Goblins going over to level 2, and actually, let's get this Clone Spell right here. Great, and we'll swap that in for the uh, the Mirror. Oh my god, yeah. Oh, we've got more. Hold on, more upgrades for this. There it is. That should be it. Yeah, and then we can also upgrade the Lava Hound. Where is he? And the Executioner. We have a lot of other upgrades we can do, but we're not going to focus on those. It's the Goblin Spotlight, this video. So this is our deck. We got the Goblin Gang, Goblins, Clone Spell, Spear Goblins, Goblin Barrel, Goblin Hunt. Hut, dark goblins, and then a golem. It's just G's everywhere. And I am gonna get trashed. I do have one win on this classic challenge, which is just mind-blowing because I do suck at this game just completely. All right, here we go, guys. This is it. This is it. We're using our all golem deck on this against uh, this, this Arabic... I think that's Arabic. Arabic, man. And I don't think I'm gonna waste any time. I think I'm just gonna drop the golem right here, and we're gonna just have fun with him. Because I didn't start with my goblin hut, so we're going golem in. Uh oh he's got, uh... He's got that. He's got the prince. Oh, the golem should get up there before that, though. Maybe. Oh, okay. Well, the raid's over. <laughs> we lost. He's got the one thing that's just going to ruin us. <sighs> the furnace. So we're going to have to watch out for that. We can get a goblin hut going in. And uh, let's see. You know what? Oh, you used arrows. Come on, come on, come on. We can goblin barrel right there. We should be able to get some serious damage on that tower. Oh, come on, tank. Yes. Woo! 1800, 1500, keep her going, 1300, nice! Okay, we knocked his tower down a lot. I actually have not even used the Goblin Gang yet. I actually forgot, I used actually a lot in that past couple seconds. I have forgotten what the Goblin Gang gives you, silly me. We're gonna drop the Dark Goblin in the back here. He does have his Sparky, that's A-OK -okay because we have a Golem, so I'm not even tripping. Watch this, ready? We're gonna drop a Golem right there, and then that's gonna take the heat off of everything, and we will be able to take out the Valkyrie, and once the Valk is down, I'm gonna go in with the Goblin Gang. Oh, he's probably gonna use arrows, too. Should I clone spell? I feel like cloning right now is a bad idea, because the arrows are probably coming in. Wait, wait, right now, clone, clone. Oh, oh, no! Rest in peace! Oh, he hit me with the arrows right before, but we got all of the Golems on the tower, the baby Golems, the Golemites, and we're gonna take it with the Goblin Army. Boom, there we go, that is tower number one. We're not done with this guy. 
We're gonna wreck this guy. He hasn't even touched us yet. And we're already just smacking the absolute hell out of him. So let's get our spear goblins in right there to help against that goblin or the goblin, the minion horde. And uh, we're gonna let them take care of that because we, and he, he'll get, what, two, three hits off on the tower? Give it to him. If he keeps pushing that left side, he's an idiot. He's, okay, he is an idiot. All right, let's see. Let's get goblins in. We got the goblin hut. Doing good. Let's get the goblin gang going in. Get out of here, elite barbarians. That is just getting smashed. Oh my gosh, dude. The goblin gang is beast. And then I guess if he's going to keep pushing this other side, we're going to have to keep pushing it too. I'm going to throw the goblin back here. We might have to push this guy for the three crown. It might have to happen. And then spear goblins in right there. He's pushing with Sparky. Let's get the goblins going. And then we're actually, once he fires, we're going to get the goblin gang in right there. And we're going to completely annihilate any dreams or hopes of that push doing anything and then we're gonna keep pushing on the left side with the golem now the question is do I want to defend this right side no we're good we're good I don't even care ready goblin barrel in right there we're gonna go dark goblin right here you dig and then we're gonna go spear goblins as well okay we're gonna keep pushing this tower and I'm gonna wait till I get the goblin gang all right now he does have arrows though so we have to watch you know what goblin gang going in clone spell and then I'm gonna get the oh uh, goblin barrel come on come on come on pull him over oh yes ah arrows one second left, it doesn't even matter, man. The Goblin Cycle deck with the clone spell, complete beast. We just root, he didn't know what to do. Who the hell in the right mind would use the deck that I'm using right now? That's why we won, because nobody's expecting it whatsoever. Two wins, baby. Yo, let's keep this going, man. We found a good deck, we are in the groove right now. We've got Mr. Anderson. Mr. Anderson. And we're gonna be going in right here, he's a level eight, so I'm gonna give him a good luck because he is going to need it, boy. We're going in on this guy. Let's do the spear goblins back here. Oh boy, okay, dark goblin right there. Pew, pew, pew. He got some shots off, I'll, I'll give that to him. Uh-oh, arrows, really, bro? Are you sure you wanted to use those arrows right there? He uses arrows, and that's great news for us. Now, we just gotta, we, I have to cycle through all of my not great stuff, and then, oh, you know what, watch this, ready? We're going here, we're going here. We're doing it, we're doing it. Full push, full push, get in, get in. Clone spell. No, every time. Well, we got the clone on those goblins, and we should take the tower. It's gonna go down. It doesn't even matter, bro. Get that up. Okay, we almost took the tower. We were we, <laughs> we were this close. We're right there. Okay, now he's got a golem down, which is kind of a problem. We have a lot of uh, what you call it, goblins helping, but that's not gonna do it. Actually, you know what? I think we're gonna be okay uh, because we've got some good distractions going. We've got our dark goblin in. Yeah, we're gonna be fine, dude. That is a successful defense right there. He does have us down to 1,948, so now we actually have to sit back and play defense. But, dude, we are smacking with this Mr. Anderson. We're killing with this deck. I'm very excited to see how this, how the rest of this raid goes. He is using a Golem deck, though, and he's got arrows. So he's going to kind of screw us over, but we can bait out those arrows and just completely ruin his dreams and hopes of winning this raid. I know that's not probably the perfect placement. There is, like, optimal placement for the uh, Goblin Hut, and that's not it right there, so... I'm aware of that. Hey, and the goblin just running up in there, getting that dub really quickly. We're actually gonna drop this golem back here. Now we could uh, just right off the bat push him, and I think we're going to, but I'm gonna give it a second. He's gonna laugh at us, really, really? Goblin barrel's gonna come in back here. We're gonna get our spear goblins right there. The goblin barrel should be able to take care of those archers. Yup, and then his baby dragon's gonna go down. He's gonna zap. That's not gonna get her done. And then I'm gonna use the dark goblin in behind the tower, and we are gonna take over this guy's base. Oh, he does have that inferno dragon, though. I did not know that he had that. That's okay. We're only down to 1900, and he's got an inferno dragon coming in. We're good, we're good, we're good. Ready for this? We're gonna go Goblin Hut in right there. He's got 46 seconds to make some magic happen, and I really do not think he's going to be able to. I'm gonna throw an Argolem right there. That might not be the best play, but it's gonna be the play. And then now he's, oh boy, now he's got, now he's got some serious stuff going. Okay, here we go, here we go. Let's get these guys in, let's get these guys in. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? We're gonna go here, we're gonna go there. Clone spell, oh no, oh god, GG. Oh, he's gonna take our tower right there. No, 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 no! We were so close! Okay, well now we, we can't let him get the win. He's gonna three crown us if we don't do anything about it. Oh my god, oh my god. Somebody stop this push. Woo! Okay, let's calm it down, boy, let's calm it down. All right, yeah, see, there's, he's got Zap, and he's got the, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, arrows. So, like, it's very difficult for me to win this raid. Whatever, we'll get the uh, goblins going in right there. Let's get that in right there. And then we're gonna get uh, our golem in over here. I know he's gonna just 
destroy that guy. He's, he's really pushing hard for this three crown, which I'm enjoying because we should be able to actually get in on this side. Of, dude, this freaking... Mm, I can't deal with this. You know what? We're just going to... We're going to push the problem right here. We're going to go like that. He did zap. Come on. Clone spell. Clone spell. Clone spell. Clone. Clone. Yes. No. Arrows. God. Ah. Well, we got him down to 1,600, 1,500 right there. But we're going to have to play some absolutely incredible defense in order for this raid to, to even get close to a win on our side. Yep, there's that. Okay, Spear Goblins. Let's get Goblins in right there. We're going to get the Goblin Gang in right here. We're not going to let them take that tower. Absolutely not. I am shutting your push down before it starts. Here we go. And then we're going to get our Golem going in right there. Nice. And then we're going to get the Goblin Barrel. And then, let's see. Should I clone? I feel like he's going to zap or arrow. Yeah, there are arrows. Okay, well, whatever. We're good. We're good. Here we go. Here we go. And then, come on, clone. Oh, I was going to clone, but he put in the baby dragon. Wait, wait, it doesn't even matter because we got the tower. Boom. Woo! That is win number two. We're going to give him a good game. That was a very good game. GG to Mr. Anderson. If you're watching right now, bro, that was actually an incredible match. We got him, though. He almost took us on the three crown, but we came back and sniped that tower. Yo, this thing works. This strategy works. All right, we're going in for one more battle. Third time is a charm. Let's see if we can pull off this last one. I'm actually pretty excited. We're doing, like, ridiculously good for this. I And I don't know why. Okay, Mr. Senda, here we go. We're going to give a thumbs up. And now the question is, do I want to be, be, like, extremely aggressive and push with that golem right away? You know what? No, we're going spear goblins first. Uh oh, elixir pump. Here we go. This is, this is our time to shine. We're going to go golem in. You dig? Okay, he's got Executioner. That's gonna be a great play. We do have the Goblin Barrel, though. Will he defend? Uh, kind of, sort of, yes, he will defend. Let's see, can we, though? Can we clone? We're gonna clone the Golems! Here we go. Oh, that was that was just a bad... <laughs> that was kind of a waste of a clone. Whatever. I mean, it wasn't a waste of a clone. We got that down quite a bit, but that Executioner... You know, I just thought about this. Uh-oh. Yep, good game. All right, that's, that's over. Yep, we're done. The Executioner is going to absolutely ruin us during this raid. Like, 100% just end this battle for us. So, we don't have any hope right now of winning. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's all she wrote. I said, I said it happened. If somebody had, like, a deck that was good against what we're using, we were going to get smacked. And we are now getting smacked. So, I, I can't say I didn't see this coming. Oh, God. Oh, yep, yep, GG. All right, you know what? I'm quitting. He won. He beat that. I'm retiring from Clash Royale. Thank you guys for watching. I'll, uh, I'll see y'all later. I'm just kidding, but we just got murdered there. That was an absolute just slaughter. <laughs> GG. Just, yeah, if somebody had the perfect deck to go up against me, they were going to kill me. And that's what happened. I just died. But that was today's brand new video. I am trying to have a lot more fun with this game. I know I was raging a lot because like when I, I'm, I'm a big tryhard when it comes to video games. So when I don't do good, I get pretty annoyed. So I've been trying to like try less and care less about winning. I know winning obviously is like the main priority of this game, but I'm just going to play this game for fun now because I'm not really like seriously grinding it. I'm just playing it to play it because I do enjoy the game, but that was our goblin deck with the brand new goblin gang. That was actually incredibly fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and comment down below. Let me know if you guys want to see more Clash Royale videos because I can definitely make that happen. But I'll see you guys in the next Clash Royale video. Peace out. The pretty girls in class still they never reply but never say never they never get caught on my mind I'm trying to get better and grind measure my effort and skill gets better in time Fresher than ever and I am who I am no taking it back I'm alive and well